The riders remain in Brussels for stage two, and it's an important one, a 27.6 kilometer team time trial around the Belgian capital. The GC favorites looking to make valuable time gains or limit their losses. Now, Team Ineos had a chaotic lead up to the tour, losing Chris Froon to injury. But with defending champion Geraint Thomas and rising star Egan Bernal, they still boast at two of the race favourites, setting the tone here with a fine opening effort of 29 minutes and 18 seconds. Well, there were a few spills to go with the thrills at Group Armour FDJ, finishing with four riders after David Godu's late crash. But it was still a solid effort from Thibaut Pino and co, only 12 seconds down on Ineos. France's other big hope though, Roman Bardet shipped a minute with AG Tuala Mondial. Katusha Alperson were the first to threaten Ineos' time. National TT champions Alex Dowsett and Jose Gonsalves getting them to within six seconds. Team Sunweb also falling just short in the absence of Tom Dumoulin. It was a rather disappointing effort though from Mitchelton Scott given their time trialling pedigree. The Yates brothers and their teammates 21 seconds down on Ineos. Now the Koenig Quickstep had made no secret of targeting this stage win. They were neck and neck with Ineos heading towards the finish line at the Atomium. Julian Alaphilippe and co missing out by the finest of margins, only 0.8 seconds. Jumbo Visma meanwhile were on a mission, going full gas to defend Mike Turnison's yellow jersey. They had 16 seconds in hand at the second checkpoint. Wout van Aert leading the remaining five riders to the line as they made it back-to-back -back wins. Ineos were the first to start. They've waited for a long time and now they step away from the podium because Jumbo Visma have done it again. Turnison defends yellow and he extends his lead. Well, Dutch team Jumbo Visma are clearly enjoying themselves just over the border here in Belgium. That is now two wins in two days and they saw off team Ineos here by a remarkable 20 seconds. Everyone worked so hard for this. It was a really big goal for us uh, that it turns out like this. It's, uh, it's, it's unbelievable. Uh, I cannot, uh, cannot say anything else than uh, to thank Jumbo, to thank Fisma, to thank everyone in the team uh, for all their hard work. And uh, this one is for them. Well, they may not have been the favourites today, but Jumbo Visma blew the rest out of the water. Powered along by the four-time world time trial champion, Tony Martin, and the irrepressible Van Aert, who takes the white jersey. Turnison will enjoy at least another day in the Maillot Jaune. It is a black and yellow party at the top of the standings, with Jumbo Visma occupying the top five spots. Gianni Moscon's the highest place of the Ineos riders, 30 seconds back, with Elia Viviani squeezing into the top ten for the Koenig Quickstep.